you know, people in adolescence, especially people of a certain personality configuration, have some trouble settling into a stable identity. And for a variety of reasons, it can be high negative emotion, which is associated with low self-esteem. Those are more or less the same thing. And then, in all likelihood, high trait openness, which is the creativity dimension. And the high trait openness people, they're the ones that are more likely to have green hair and red hair and lots of piercings and lots of tattoos and dress in a somewhat, in a non-standard manner, let's say. That's all associated with creative behavior. And they have trouble catalyzing a single identity. And then if you throw in categorical confusion, which is exactly what you're doing when you declare that there's, you know, an endless number of gender identities, then people who are prone to identity dissociation and to psychogenic contagion, they're, you're going to demolish them. There is an Abigail Schreier has documented that quite nicely in, in her book, uh, Irreversible Damage. 